<laughs> so I'm looking at over Copacabana and I'm about to show you how to craft in <laughs> Five Hole. Ooh, that's loud. I need some health. So the first thing you do is don't fall off a cliff and go splat. <laughs> I'm just going to bring up my stream so I can see if anyone's oh, talking to me. You looking to cover up that thing on your face? I'll tell you what. I've got plenty of maps. Everyone gets to see a stream within a stream is within a stream. You didn't know this about me. Ah. But I'm also a licensed hairstylist. Yeah, man. So you first you find the um, molecular printer stations in Kakubana. And you'll see this screen. With a Q, if it likes to, would like to show up. Nope. So the first thing you need to do is refine your ore. So you go to refining process and then roll resource refining. Okay, my user interface is actually stuffed up. I'm just going to reset it quickly. All right, the job there we go. done. Head on over to the closest manufacturing station. So normally you go re raw resource refining, and you get a list of the resources down the bottom here. Now the first number is the quality, second number is how much you have of it. How much you have on it determines exactly how many seconds it takes to manufacture. 96 would be a minute 36, 90, minute 30, 131, etc. Now you can see over here, so you basically you just click one, click manufacturer, wait that many seconds and it's done. When it's done, you click on it, and it says, 161, oh sorry, um, 161 high tensile metals were made with 335 quality. The other one, two crystal hybrids which I don't actually use for anything, 232 quality, 178 energized carbon. That's pretty straightforward. So if you want to make a gun, it's under battle frame modules. When you pick your um, suit, I'm wearing the assault suit, but like if you want to go biotech recluse, Go Biotech Recluse, and you'll be using the Bio sh Crossbow and the Bio Crossbow one. Okay. So, like for the Bio Crossbow one, you can click on it, and it tells you what you need. You need an Energizer and a, like, a Quiver. So, you can see the Energizer is here, and it requires metal, of which I don't have enough. And the Quiver requires ceramic insulators of which I have 4,000 worth, so that's plenty. Um, I'm going to make an assault weapon though. So I'm using the Accord, I'm using a sword, a cult, uh, the Accord Assault um, Frame, which uses the plasma cannon. Now, the Tech 2 stuff requires you to unlock the, lev the Tier 2 green areas in your frame, and I haven't done that yet, so there's no point making them. So I need to make a cannon, which requires cannon, barrel, metal, and reactor ceramics. So unfortunately, I need to go out. Ah, I'll find it somewhere. I need to refine some metal that I just picked up. So if we look through compounds, 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 metals, metals, metals. So yeah. I'll have this turned around for you in no time. So of course, if you don't have enough metals, you have to go out and refine it. Which will they take a minute and a half. Um, yeah, my friend's asking, with ceramic, is it insulated? Yes, it is. So it's pretty much, it, there's um, four different kinds of materials. There's bios, carbons, um, ceramics, and metals. Oh, there's polymers as well. Five? However many there are, but each each thing requires one type. Now this is where it gets confusing, because you've got different types of ingredients, so I'm just going to bring up my inventory. Oops. Okay, it's not normally meant to come up in the background, it's meant to come up in the foreground. Um, it's been bugging out now. So I'm just going to exit. Craft. 
So while that's crafting away, if you go into your inventory and your crafting materials, you can see all these materials here. I sort it by name twice so I can get an actual name order. And you can see on each material, oh, it's not doing it today. Okay, there we go. See how it has power, mass, and CPU. So it has a quality, 328, which is the quality of the highest material quality. In this case, high strength polymers, 328 mass, 328 quality. But you can also use it for CPU and power. CPU will be 216. Over. The moment has arrived. Your new toy is ready at your friendly neighborhood manufacturing station. And power would be 108. Of course, he's telling me that my... <laughs> he's telling me that my refining's finished. <laughs> so it's like you can use any material, or well, in all the raw ones, you can use any material, but some materials are more suited to make some things than others. So when you make something, you want to use the highest quality material that you can get your hands on. At the moment though, carbon is carbon. It's an element, not a metal. Why don't you head over to the manufacturing station? Got something shiny and new for you there. I'm wondering if that gave me enough. No. Nope. So you can see, this is the quality. So I've clicked on that. It tells me... Okay, so I'll start over. So if you click on plasma cannon, you can see what's required. So I need a cannon barrel. I can click create new component and it goes to create that. And then I can click metals and it shows you a list of metals. So I need 350 and I have 291. So I'm going to go thumping for another 20 minutes and I'll be back with part 2. So when I come back with part 2 I'll be able to actually show you how to do it. So we need to go thumping for metals. Um, and once we have enough metals we'll come back.